Hey guys. Um, right, today has been one of those days. Yeah, still got no news on the laptop. Um, massive shout out to uh, Trucker Brothers High Up Life. I'll put either a card up here or a link in the video description to his channel. Still no further news away the laptop. Uh, well, I haven't done a huge amount today, I went on a bike ride, nothing too interesting. Um, what else was there? I could potentially, well this is only potentially, go to Trackfest Peterborough. It is still running. If you are interested in going, I'll put a link to their website in the video description. Um, I have spoken to Trucker Will. He's going up with his truck. Um, he's been told I was working. It's a one-way system and obviously two metre distance and all that good stuff. Um, I do not know whether Master required or not. He didn't mention anything on that. Um, when my laptop is back, this is when it gets interesting. Because... We have a run to Manchester, an empty, um, an empty trail to Manchester. We are collecting uh, packaged food. As you guys probably know from previous videos, I haul packaged food quite regularly. Uh, yeah, kind of got a bit of a multi drop. And a whopper of a one. We are going to Dover, Southampton, London, Birmingham, Birmingham, uh, Cambridge, times two, Felix Stowe, Swansea, Swansea, uh, Cardiff, back to Swansea, Liverpool, Liverpool, um, Grimsby, Newcastle, Carlisle, Aberdeen, Glasgow, Edinburgh. Uh, Birmingham back round to Manchester so it is quite a run it's about um, an 800 mile round trip um, if you're going to put the hive on I'll just have to run to the yard real quick and grab the paperwork um, Cardiff Quarry works still on Painfully, um, but just to really top everything off, we've also got an abnormal load to move. The driver that was originally going to take it, he now can't take it, so that leaves one more stuck cargo driver, which is me. So we have also got, on top of all my regular runs. Uh, some sort of complex thing. I, I don't really know what it is. What I know is it's long and blading awkward. Um, in terms of weight, I don't know how heavy it is. But what I do know is it is quite a heavy load. So I will probably use the uh, newer 750 with the um, I shift automatic transmission. Um, that being said, I could be in the Scania though, which would be nicer because I think it's a 750, uh, 750, a 730, which is a V8, which is the most powerful engine Scania have produced. Um, I'll have to double check on that one. If you check the comments, I will let you guys know what's happening on that. But what I know is it's awkward and heavy and it could be interesting. And it's from London to Felix, so, so possibly one of the worst routes possible. Um, what else? Oh, yeah, Trump Fest Peterborough. Um, I know Trucker Wheels are going. Um, I potentially am going. Um, 
that's the only potential that I don't know yet. Depends on how everything else blends out and transport and all that good stuff. Um, so that could be a, well, quite a long day. Um, what have I got done today? Not a lot. <laughs> it's been, I've been in quite a bit of pain today, so I haven't tried to do too much. Um, I've been on a bike ride. Uh, I've still trying to fix my fan. It will, the actual fan works, it just won't rotate. Um, so the, I'll show you what I mean. So when it's when these things here in the middle are rotating, I'll just quickly show you. So when that's moving, and I put down the lever at the back, it should rotate. However, it won't. It keeps jamming like that. So I have to assist it. So I don't quite know what's going on there. So I'm going to take it apart and see if I can fix it. It is quite an old fan, so I think it's probably past its uh, use by date. Um, plan for tomorrow, so I'm trying to get some cleaning done, got a driving lesson. Um, what a lot of people don't know is that if I'm driving one of the 12 speed manual trucks, so the older, the 105 DAF, uh, which I think, and the Renault, I think it's the Magna or the Premium, I can't remember, but one of those two is also a 12 speed manual. Um, I run it as a 3 over 3, so I've got a 12 in second, so 2L, 3L. Range up. You worry at the idea of it, but it's a three over three, so three low gears, three high gears, all that good stuff. Um, I'm doing with you guys know this. I am not a fan of uh, automatic. Obviously, when we were out doing all the work in the US, I was in the automatic Volvo um, for a lot of the time. Don't mind driving the automatic Volvo because I can. I, I I've gotten used to driving it. I, I would prefer something that's manual, but it is what it is. Um, however, we could be doing a couple of quite long days because uh, I've also been doing essential goods the rest of the week. <laughs> Um, I know Monday isn't essential good, so I'll prob probably end up just doing a fair scene. But I know that I will be doing... I know... Uh, there, hang on. Monday I will be doing Swansea Cardiff and stuff. Uh, switching trailers. Uh, and units, for that fact and getting loaded. Now, if I've got driving hours spare, I will go as far as I can, but I suspect I'll have to do a night out. Um, where else is there? I could be in the T-range as well at some point. I put in a request not to be in it because Quite frankly, it's not powerful enough. Uh, it just doesn't have the right amount of torque. <coughs> and for, for me in general, it is just a pain to drive. To uh, drive. Um... One thing that I do know for sure is I'll definitely be in our MAN. Me and MAN don't mix. Uh, only reason why is I'll need to get my truck. Uh, my truck's 
I do believe, well, this is only potential, it might not happen. If um, I do have to go and get my truck, then it's a quick trip to the other yard in Southampton, I've got two yards, uh, and it's there. It's off the map, so if you if you are playing ECS2, it's just outside the barriers. If you had a, so where the recruitment agency is, if you had a, I think a, a left, so you're going away from. Uh, I don't know where it is. From the supermarket delivery point, then it's. Uh, about 200 meters further up. Um, I'll be running Taco, um, obviously, for from the UK. Um, don't know on, uh, on the Volvo F Series yet about if that's released yet or not. If it is released, I'll probably try and rock that for a day or two. Because, as you know, it is my favourite track. I do like the older trucks. I just don't like the swing clutch. Um, but being said, guys, I have rambled on for far too long. Um, hopefully, where as soon as my laptop's back, you'll know because I will upload the rest of the Utah footage and I'll try as a separate video. That won't be a lockdown day video. That'll be just random add-on footage. I might add it into um, when I'm going from Southampton to Manchester. I won't record the whole journey because it is quite literally M3, M25, A1, M1, M4, <laughs> pretty much. Um, I might skip out the A1 actually. I might just do um, M3 over to Wales and go that way. Anyway, uh, that being said guys, I hope you guys have enjoyed the stock update. Um, sorry I've rambled on quite a bit. Um, if you guys have enjoyed the video, give it a big thumbs up. Uh, don't forget to go over, subscribe to my channel, subscribe to Trekker Wheels channel. If you've got any comments, queries or concerns, let me know. And I'll put a link in the video description and in the comments to Trekfest Peterborough. Uh, for more information, you can look on their website too. Um, if you've got any further questions, don't f please feel free to ask. Myself or Chuckle Will, we'll, we will try our best to answer them. And uh, yeah, until then, we'll see you in the next video. Bye for now.